Hey guys, what's up? Happy Labor Day. Turning up. I am not turning up. I am actually home having a nice quiet afternoon. Um, actually tuning in to at 1000 Families Boot Camp all day today. It's all about um, the business right now. Just learning more, getting in tuned, staying aligned. Definitely going to have me some. This is the original tea already mixed in, my bottle of water. I'm just going to add my CBD, um, raspberry flavor, IASO tea. This CBD tea that I'm adding to the original tea that actually um, detoxes the body, removes chemicals and toxins from the large intestines and um, it also has a calming effect it also you know has a cool like um, just a cool calm detox gentle detox removing the bad from your body um, so, you guys need to definitely get in my DM so that I can send you these samples here for free. It comes just like this. And you just empty it into a bottle of water, just like how I'm doing. Um, this is one of my favorite flavors, the raspberry. A bit sweet, so I mix it with the original and sometimes I mix it with the lemon so you have a variety of flavor and if you're not really into CBD which I would suggest you guys Google CBD and see what it does for your system and then you can make a decision whether you want to try it or not but I'm pretty much just relaxing having a quiet moment um, just actually reaching out to people if you are interested in trying the CBD detox tea or the original flavor uh, I can send this out to you free I just want you to hit me back with your name number email and address so I can send it out to you today definitely guys enjoy your labor day regardless of what's going on um, it's pretty quiet here the kids are asleep good stuff so I'm gonna go ahead and just enjoy my little tea and um So, we also have the CBD um, drops, which is the Harmony Drops Full Spectrum Hemp Extract that I'm also into because um, I've noticed that with planning of the girls' birthdays, work, projects, that I was becoming a little bit antsy kind of um staying up late not really resting very much so i decided to go ahead and since i took some time off from work which i didn't have to but since i have the time off start implementing more CBD into my diet um, it does give you a calm controllable um, effect where you you just kind of feel better you 
this is um all over relief it's an all natural relief so sometimes if you have constant headaches or if you feel like a lot is going on and you would like to just you know remain calm or like i like that word homeostasis I think I heard Coach Stormy say it. It returns us to our normal homeostasis. And if that's the case, then I want that. Because um, sometimes you notice there's a lot going on around you. And you think you're not being affected by it. But you are. You could be nervous or feeling stressed. Your stress levels go up, causing headaches, causing confusion. Um, you just want to be aware of what you're doing. So between my Harmony Drops, my CBD tea, we also have a, a Alleviate, which is the hemp um, pain relief cream. But it also can be used for uh, workout purposes because it you can rub it on your stomach because CBD burns the fat. And you wrap it with your waist trainer and you work out and you will see the sweat starts to just between the sweat and the cream it's just gonna start to take inches off of your waist and you will see how much sweat much more sweat comes off of your body when using that cream so we have all the hemp products that you need currently to start your hemp higher so if you guys are interested in creating another line or another stream of income, definitely think about Total Life Changes um, because they give you an opportunity to basically run your own business with high-end products that are affordable and actually work. So being that we are in an instant gratification type of world, these products, once you get them in your system, you will feel what they are about and you will be in turn super excited to share this. I'm sorry, I'm having a moment with this um little stocking cap I got on, but I believe that once you try these products you will want to, you would not want to stop you guys couldn't tell me i had stuff on me um once you try the products you won't want to stop and you will um you know start to feel a difference within your body which i think is what got me hooked to total life changes was that i did not expect for them the products to work so good and um, I started to think about all of the times that I wish I had these products from even younger with the Nutriverse. Um, you know, there were times when you did not notice that your body was in lack of nutrients. And no matter how much you want to um, be healthy, it takes a mind switch a mindset switch for you to go ahead and start to take in control uh, the things that you can control like your health you have to have that switch to say you know what today is a new day and I need to start a new routine because health is not gonna be just a one-time thing it's something you're gonna have to change it's a lifestyle and for those of you who are concerned with um, just being a healthier being so that you can live a lot, a lot longer, um, even though we don't know what tomorrow can bring, you want to prepare your body and strengthen your core. You want to start working out a lot more. You, the gyms are open. You want to drink your water like we always talk about. It's the same thing that we know, but sometimes you just need that switch to tell you, to remind you that you are the only person that's going to help yourself get there. So, um, being that the gyms reopened, I know 
a lot of people were super excited. I think that you take small steps and you just say, every day I want to work out for 30 minutes and you map it out in your calendar. Realistically, do you have 30 minutes a day to work out and where can you fit it in? And what gym are you going to go to? And does does all of your other activities of the day work around that? And can you implement that? And you don't need a gym to work out. You can work out from your home. Hennessy, I am Hennessy Fitness. He has his workouts twice a day, every day. Um, Maniac Mindset has his workouts so there are other resources and people who are rooting for you and you can team up with and you know and receive um the information needed sorry i'm being nosy But yeah, you could you could definitely find the things you need to No, it's So yeah, you guys can definitely find the resources and um just start pulling yourself up by the bootstraps and what I recognized um on my time away from work is that you're going to have to command yourself to do the things that you know you need to do. Like this week, I'm commanding myself to renew my license. I'm commanding myself to working out not once a day anymore, but twice a day now. I need to now command myself to prepare... uh, activities for the children for the week not going day by day figuring out what's going to go on but I have to have things now a little bit more mapped out you have to come to terms with your weaknesses my weakness is that I don't like to plan I'm more of a fly by day fly by night or whatever they say um type of person like I just make it up as I go And it works out for me and then I repeat it and then I want to change it because I do have a thing with routine. Like after a while, I don't want to do the same thing over and over. But in all actuality, that is probably what I need to strengthen my core and strengthen my, you know, my journey or to, to straighten my journey. Because you time from time, you forget that you are working on something because there's so much going around. So like today, we could be talking about, oh, we need to be working out. And then tomorrow, something happens and you take that and you pay attention to whatever happens. But you forget that you said that we will be working out at such and such time. And for those of you who are interested in joining total life changes but skeptic of the results all i can say to you is how bad do you want it and what are you willing to sacrifice to get it because what happens is again you might mention it to yourself that you want to make more money but are you willing to take the uh, sacrifices and do what it takes to actually gain that extra income because you're going to be taken away from your playtime because now once you join and you put it out there you're going to have to take that and you're going to have to make it a reality so a lot of people say they want something but when they get a taste of it they forget that there's work involved and they tend to deter from it once they see what it takes to get there so first i suggest people find out how bad do you really want your success story how bad do you want to be the success story that you can visualize how often or 
Do you even see yourself? Hi. Hey, Gladys Anderson. What's going on? Now, do you see yourself in that success story? Can you visualize yourself there? That is the question. A lot of us can talk it outside of our mouths and say, yeah, I want this amount of money. I want to drive this car. I want to live in this house. But can you see yourself driving that car? Can you see yourself living in that house? Have you seen yourself in your success story? It's sometimes the heart the what did they say the longest travel is from your heart to your mind you feel it you want it but can you visualize it and hold on to it can you actually feel how it would feel when you hold that steering wheel can you smell the smell of the new car smell how about you can feel your feet on the, the new carpet in the home that you just bought? And you can feel the room temperature. Can you see the color of the bathroom? Maybe you can actually picture yourself opening your cabinets and reaching for the utensils. Can you see down to what kind of plates you'll have? What kind of drinks are in the fridge? What color is the towel set in the restroom? What are you going to... Um, you can actually feel the wind blowing with you driving in your new vehicle. Can you do these things? Because this is a part of the work that you need to do in order to have your success story. A lot of people see other people's successes and they think that it was simple. It might have been simple to the outside looking in, but no one knows what that individual had to sacrifice or work hard at or tweak and twerk and learn and relearn and encourage themselves. No one knows what kind of internal work, mental work, physical work, or financial work this person had to do you kind of just see it and you kind of just know it's happening for them but you don't know what they had to do to get there hi rashida what's going on happy labor day guys so as you have these dreams and these desires i advise you to start to love that thought start to love that thought you have to fall in love with the thought like get emotionally attached to the success story believe in the story more than yourself sometimes you don't it's not about believing in yourself but believing in the story that you tell yourself. You might not believe that you yourself believe that you yourself can do it, but you believe the dream so much that you know it's going to happen to you. You done dreamt it. You done dreamt it up. You done seen it. You done lived it. So now it's real. So it has no choice but to manifest that's how it all starts guys it's more simple than we make it and the world honestly this place this environment is set up to make us think it's so much harder it's so difficult because the mind if not paid attention to will run away you will be sitting here talking about going to the gym and then by the end of the day 
your whole thought pattern went from gym to going out later to a barbecue or and there's nothing wrong with that but where did the thought pattern go is are you going to be on that same thought pattern tomorrow where you begin with the same thought and say I have to go to the gym and then tomorrow you say I have to go to the gym and then the next day you say I have to go if that's the case then that's just kind of uh redundant you're telling yourself you have to go to the gym, but are you taking that thought, falling in love with it so much that you have to now create it in within yourself? You already see yourself going to the gym. You got your gym bag prepared in your head. You got what you're going to wear. You got the card or you talking to whoever. You could kind of see it happening and you're picturing yourself actually in route to the gym. You could feel yourself already prepared, going, lifting the bag, walking or driving or jogging to the gym. And then you already made the connection of how much, what time, around what time you're going, how long you'll be there. You already process all of that. Now you're falling in love with the thought. Now you've done left that I have to go to the gym and now you're at the gym. Not physically, but you're at the gym. Mentally, you reach the gym. So now the next day is to command your body and command yourself to actually get up and go to the gym. You can't allow yourself to have that same redundant thought for more than that time. We have to now learn how to have a thought, fall in love with the thought, and then act upon the thought. Because action is where you bring, you start to bring it alive. No matter how small the action and how little the action may seem, as long as it's something moving you towards that thought you fell in love with. And now you have to pull out and extract more. What happens when you get to the gym? What was the first machine? Did you see somebody? Are you with someone? Are you training? Are you going somewhere? Are you showering after? Did you bring shower shoes? Are, you know, like, you have to fall in love with the thought and it becomes this reality. It becomes this reality so quickly. And now... I could feel my CVD kicking in. I feel so calm and relaxed. Thoughts are coming, but you have to also realize and decipher thoughts really quickly. That's another thing I've learned while being at home. Some thoughts come and they have nothing to do with anything that's going to benefit you, or nor do they have anything to back up the first thought that you actually had. The initial thought was, oh, I have to go to the gym. Now, the next thought should be, how, how, when am I going? Or, what am I wearing? Like, it's an action thought. Like, now you process it. Now you, now you create it. Don't go off into another thought pattern because you're going to just keep going in circles and it's too much wavering. Get that thought completely cleared and con conquered and corrected and keep it right there and, and, and grow that. For me, it's multiple things on the plate, but I have to grasp one, feng shui that one, and move on accordingly. Accordingly. And you will know because you know yourself. And that's another thing that we have to take into consideration and trust our natural instincts and to actually know that we know the things that we know that will actually be already in play. We already know what we know. There's so much that's already in play and there's things that we can do that will help advance us to where we're going because I have my CBD that's gonna keep me nice and calm. I have my CBD tea, my CBD drops, 
Harmony that we have. Click the website. And I have the Alleviate that I'm going to rub on my stomach and work out with my new waist trainers. And guys, this journey has been amazing because I am consistently talking to myself about myself and encouraging myself that I'm motivating and encouraging myself to continue to do the things that actually feel good. Now, I want to invite all my New Yorkers out October 8th. Um, 2020 at 10 a.m. to work out with Team Millionaire Minds. We will be heading to a park in Brooklyn. We might be meeting at Prospect Park October 8th at 10 a.m. Get your gears up. We will have t-shirts. We will have giveaways. We will have teas. I'm going to have tea on deck. I'm going to have Nutriverse on deck. I'm going to have NRG on deck. I'm going to have product, t-shirts, headbands, whatever you can think of. We're probably going to have it. We're going to make it a huge, huge thing for New York. Um, I'm definitely doing it for Crown Heights, Brooklyn, because I don't see a lot of people out here really on their health journey. So I want to bring that awareness to this area, neighborhood. And just let our people know that we can control that part of our lives, making us a lot more healthier and, you know, bringing joy to our health and wealth. And not to mention that we have a way that you can now earn extra income. You can actually, you know, earn extra money for the week. We are the only network marketing company right now getting daily pay. And guys, this is no cap. You can earn money with this company because these products sell themselves. And once again, once you get this in your system, you will feel it. These are products you feel. They will change some course of your health and wellness journey where they will make you so aware that you will want to be involved you will want to take the product you will want to tell people about the product and you'll become a product of the product all right so i just wanted to get on get a little interaction with you guys tell you about these cbd products that i have and i'm also going to tell you to go to at 1000